Speaker is a champion of the anti-fracking movement in the Senate and sponsor of the bill to ban fracking in New York, Senator Tony Avella. <laughs> I want to thank all of you for coming out and proving once again that this is the single largest grassroots effort that has ever occurred in the United States. And as the previous speaker said, we are not afraid. The person who should be afraid for his political ambitions is Governor Cuomo. I've said it before and I'm saying it again here. Governor Cuomo, if you allow hydrofracking in this state and that first contaminated well, which we all know will come, your presidential ambitions are done. For New York State to even be considering hydrofracking given the evidence we already have from other states, is just mind-boggling. Yes. You know, during the, during, I know many of you were at the budget hearing this morning, and uh, you know, I questioned Commissioner Martens about the uh, so-called mitigation that he's thinking about. Well, there is one way to mitigate this. Never do it in the first place. I remember when we first started this battle. There were a few of us at the first rally. There were hundreds at the next. And now we have thousands. We are going to win. I need all of you, in terms of my colleagues, we have the Democratic Senate Conference behind the ban. We have some IDC members behind the ban. We have no Republican senators behind the ban. We have some assembly members behind the ban. I need all of you, when you get back to your districts, to call your senator, your assembly member. Don't buy the excuse, well, I, I'm thinking about this, I'm thinking about that. Are they signed on to the ban bill? Yes. Don't let them get off. If everybody signs on to the ban bill in the legislature, you and us in the legislature, the governor is going to get this message big time. So let's keep the fight going. Not one well. Right. Not